neighbors, wow. You know, there are some people on my road that I live on I've never seen in the 16 years I've lived on this road. I, 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 I know there's lights on, but I've never seen anybody drive in. I've never seen anybody walk out. And I, I, I'm out all the time, well, not all the time, but quite a bit. And I love talking to my neighbors. Now, even during lockdown, I stay on my property, they stay on their property, but we talk. And, and, and what I've learned during this COVID-19, I think I'm getting to know the neighbors better now than ever before. One of the things I've been doing recently is trying to minister to them, but in a, in a positive way, which doesn't turn them off. One of the people in our church did something that was absolutely amazing at Christmas time. They went and bought this leaf strobo, a case for Christmas, and they wrapped it up in Christmas paper, and they put their name on it. Listen, from your neighbor, at such a, and put their address on it, and went around and put it at every neighbor's door. I mean, this is the time with COVID-19 where people are locked down or people are in their homes more than... And yes, we're out shoveling snow, and yes, we're out... Uh, this is a great time to get to know your neighbors. The other day, we were talking to one of our neighbors. They were going for an exercise walk because they're elderly and they need to walk. And, and they're lonely. And they stood on the street. We stood on our driveway. Uh, we were more than six meters apart, but they just needed to talk. And we had the opportunity of just sharing the love of Jesus with them. Take responsibility for this moment and use it to show the love of Jesus to your neighbors. That's the thought of the week.